Hey, this is Math Minds. This mind-blowing question will test your skills. Let's start with a rectangle that has a height of 8 and a base of 4. Now, duplicate this rectangle, rotate it, and slide it back so that their opposite corners overlap. The question is, can you determine the overlapping area of these two rectangles? Feel free to pause the video now if you'd like to try solving it yourself. Then, come back and check your solution. All right, let's dive into the solution. We will use the Pythagorean theorem and triangle congruence to solve this. Now, focus on this triangle at the bottom and this triangle at the top. By the vertical angles theorem, this angle is congruent to the corresponding angle above. Since both triangles are right triangles, their remaining angles must also be congruent. This tells us that the two triangles are similar. Now, notice that the leg of the upper triangle is equal to the base of the rectangle. So this length is 4. Since the triangles share two congruent angles and a side, they must be congruent by the angle-side-angle theorem. Let's label the other leg of this triangle as X. Because the triangles are congruent, the corresponding leg of the upper triangle is also X. Now, look at the hypotenuse of the upper triangle. Its length is 8 minus X. Since the bottom triangle is congruent to the upper one, its hypotenuse must also be 8 minus X. Using the Pythagorean theorem on the bottom triangle, we set up the equation. X squared plus 4 squared equals 8 minus X squared. Expanding and simplifying. X squared plus 16 equals 64 minus 16. X plus X squared. Canceling X squared from both sides. 16X equals 48. Solving for x, x equals 3. Substituting x back, the hypotenuse of our triangle is 8 minus 3 equals 5. Now, focus on this red triangle. Its base is 5, and its height is the same as the rectangle's base, which is 4. So, the area of this red triangle is one-half times base times height. So the area will be one-half times five times four, which is equal to ten. Similarly, the area of the other red triangle is also ten. Now, let's return to our sketch. The overlapping area is the sum of these two triangle areas. So the overlapping area is ten plus ten. So the overlapping area is equal to 20. And that's our solution. But wait, can you find the overlapping area of these two rectangles for length of A and B instead of 8 and 4? Drop your answer in the comments below. I hope you enjoyed this interesting problem. If you did, leave a like and consider subscribing to MathMinds for more exciting math content. If you have any problems, suggestions, or topics you'd like me to cover, feel free to reach out via email. Details are in the description below. And as always, until next time, take care.